Our strength comes from union with Russia. In the Transdenistra city of Tiraspol, it's clear where loyalties lie. The breakaway region in eastern Moldova declared independence in 1990, but many people here are keen on a permanent union with Russia. Russia backs us, guarantees our future. It helps us. I think things would be good with Russia, and even if we can't join them, it would be good if we could at least be independent of Moldova. The majority of the population here are Russian speakers. The parliament still bears the old Soviet-era name Supreme Council, overlooked by a statue of Lenin. The Russian Federation is the worthy successor of the USSR. Transdenistra and Moldova were born out of the collapse of the Soviet Union, and that's why our people still look towards Russia. But neither Russia, Moldova nor the international community recognizes this separatist region. The recent conflict in Georgia, though, where Russian forces stepped in to help two breakaway pro-Russian regions, has brought fresh hope. We hope that Russia is beginning to feel sufficiently sure of itself on the international stage. It wanted to recognize South Ossetia and Abkhazia, and it did. And that gives us hope that one day Russia will do the same for Transdenistria. And while recognition is something that people like Dmitry are still willing to fight for, it's unlikely to come. Moscow has promised to stay out of Moldova's internal disputes, as long, that is, as it remains outside of NATO.